This week's 24-7 Rewind comes to you from Ramsgate, Kent, and the Global Generation Church, which is the headquarters for Revival Run. Uh, today we're going to be meeting with Mike Andrea, who's the founder of Revival Run. We're we'll doing that in just a second. On the website this week, we have our feature, which is called uh, Church Partner Headbanger Author, and it's introducing Roger Ellis, and he's going to be taking our 24-7 Academy. On the blog this week, we have Lindsay from 24-7 USA, and she's got a thing called Let's Call It Church. It's just a story of some of the things that they're seeing in Kansas City, real powerful piece, so please check that out. Then we also have Edwin from Holland, just talking about his personal journey of uh, a 24-7 prayer room. He works really closely with the universities and the students in Holland. And our final blog piece this week is uh, celebrating the one-year anniversary of Revival Run. And Revival Run is this great idea where we just take these prayer stakes and as a prophetic act, we just pray our biggest, boldest prayers for a place that we don't call home. And that leads us into our interview this week, which is with Mike Andrea, who founded Revival Run. So we're just going to cut straight into that. And here we are with Mike Andrea. Yeah. And we just thought with the one-year anniversary of Revival Run, we come down and get an interview with him and get him to tell us all about the vision yeah, so Revival Run this year, um, one year old, which has been absolutely amazing, and started with all these little prayer stakes. And in the last year, we've seen 26,000 Revival Runs happen all over the world, um, thousands of those within the UK, simply praying for an unprecedented move of God wherever. That The agenda isn't we want God to do bless me prayers, but we're just desperate to see God move. And if that's in the most remote place in the world, then fine. But we just want to see an outpouring of God's presence like we've read about and we dream about. And it has been absolutely remarkable. So year two, um, the vision's got bolder, it's got brighter. And we're encouraging churches to go and pray for all their local churches and revive one of them locally. So for us, we're going to pray for 63 churches in this year. Um, prayer stake them every Sunday night, pray prayers of blessing, prophesy over them, and then we're sending them a gift in the week, which is amazing. And then the big one, we just decided, hey, we want a revival run all 196 capital cities of the world, opening it up to the 24-7 international community and saying, help us pray unprecedented prayers of blessing globally. We don't care where God moves, we're just desperate for God to move in our nation and the nations, and um, that's Revival Run for these next few years, probably. And who knows where it will lead us. Excellent. So who can do Revival Run? Is it like just for the special, or can everyone get involved? Anybody of any age. I mean, turn your holidays into Revival Runs, turn your trips to work on Revival Runs. I mean, whatever you do, make your own prayer stake or contact us, we'll give you a load. But wherever you go, turn it into a God adventure. And we've had this phrase, be the adventure, any age, any destination, just go for it and um, just have fun, you know, because God is full of fun and he just wants us to just be desperate for him to move. And um, we've seen so many things and I believe it's just the beginning. Excellent. Okay, and so with the vision of Revival Run, you always use this, use your biggest, boldest prayers. So we're just wondering if you could just give us an example. Well, use... my bold prayer at the moment is um, in Matthew, there's a point where Jesus says, I've come to set the world on fire. And we just said, you know, that, that's what we want to be. So can I pray for us? Yeah, yeah, Father, I just pray for us as community, wherever we are watching Rewind right now, that you would be bold enough to set us on fire, that we in our lives would set the world on fire through prayer, through a heart of mission and a heart compelled for justice, that we would be radical in our faith, desperate to see you move and generous of everything we've got. And I just pray, God, your kingdom come in us, your will be done. And may we be the adventure today. In Jesus' name, 